Thanks so much for joining me on the Slice of Healthcare podcast. How are you today? Fantastic. Thanks for having me. I'm excited to, to chat. We've been, uh, we connected a while back, followed your, your company and uh, look forward to learning more about you. And I'd love if you could just give the audience a, a quick background and then we'll talk about Gift Health. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, so my name is Nick Potts. I've been in healthcare technology for about 10 years now. Um, those 10 years have flown by. I first started at Cover My Meds um, when they were pretty small, between 40 and 50 employees and joined the pharmacy team at, at Cover My Meds. So helped to integrate pharmacy management systems into Cover My Meds' API for prior authorizations. So it was a cool role for me to learn the technical side and the business side um, and kind of learn a lot in healthcare really, really quickly. Uh, worked there about three years um, and then about five years ago founded a company called ScriptDrop and the thesis for ScriptDrop was pretty simple at the time of using my knowledge of building software that pharmacists would use and, you know, building it in a really elegant, integrated fashion, except changing the end product and solution to offering prescription delivery so that they could click a button, it would call a courier to pick up a prescription, drop it off at the patient's home. So over the four years that I was the CEO there, uh, raised about 30 million from investors, um, scaled the solution to close to 15,000 pharmacies across the country and made three or 4 million deliveries or so. Um, last May or June, uh, kind of had the opportunity to step back from script drop, spent maybe three months just researching the industry, studying kind of just uh, really sharpening my understanding of the prescription workflow um, in areas that I didn't know as well previously. And in, at the end of 2020, had the opportunity to co-found Gift Health with my co-founder, John Romano. Um, and what we're doing is essentially helping patients get on therapy um, easier with less friction and then saving them money, so cheaper. And we function, think of us as a prescription brain. So prescriptions can be sent to our platform and then we help the patient save money, and then we will transfer that prescription to one of our network pharmacies that are across the nation that have kind of agreed to our SLAs of, you know, keeping that copay low or applying vouchers that are available and then getting that free same day delivery to the patient. This is kind of, I guess, a rhetorical question, but I'd like to hear, hear your view on it. Um, or I know the answer is yes, but so starting script dropped, uh, script drop. How did what you learned while working on that venture, what were some of the takeaways that you're able to now utilize at Gift Health? Yeah. So, well, one is just learning how to build a company and, you know, build a team and get everyone aligned on a vision, um, learning to raise capital from investors and communicating that vision to them and actually executing on it. Uh, but the biggest learning and the biggest change that we've made at Gift Health versus how ScriptDrop was built is at ScriptDrop, we were so far down the, the at the end of the patient journey um, and workflow that it kind of restricted innovation in a way um, that by the time you're getting a prescription delivered, you as a patient could have had a really terrible experience already. Um, you know, at the physician's office or at the pharmacy, if you had to go in two or three times to see if they had inventory and they weren't backed up. Um, and it was hard for us to kind of save that experience, even if we did our job and, you know, it was great on that one little piece. Um, it, sometimes it was still kind of too insurmountable for us to save. So with Gift Health, we're at the beginning of that patient prescription journey. The prescription is sent to our platform so we can tangibly impact your experience in a very direct way, which is incredibly exciting. What are some of the things that you're really excited about? Because now you're, you're about that, at that one year mark for, for Gift Health. What are some of the things you're looking forward to heading into, I guess, year two of the company? Yeah, so just continuing to work with the team we have. Uh, we have a lot of amazing team members that uh, i I'm incredibly energized just being around. Um, and then we're now starting to roll out our software across the nation. So we ran a pretty intense pilot with a couple of partners. So how we ran that is we acquired an operational pharmacy in Columbus, Ohio. And uh, 
it functions as two for two parts, essentially to be a resource for our community so that we can, you know, work with Columbus and the state of Ohio to dispense prescriptions and really create that elegant patient experience. But it's a, also a, a software test kitchen for us to build features and then run those features within our pharmacy to understand how they impact adherence and abandonment in a really controlled environment. And then our software engineers can go into the pharmacy and they can get energized by seeing their features in a live production environment, and kind of understanding everything more tangibly. Um, and we ran a pretty large pilot with a partner and we raised their adherence by about 100% uh, for, for that drug. Um, so we put together a custom program, custom workflow, kind of custom patient touch points. And then now that partner is rolling that out across the nation. And we've been able to use that case study to start selling our platform to telehealth companies, to pr large provider groups, and then the large pharmaceutical manufacturers. Um, and it's really, really exciting to show that, you know, if you increase adherence by 100%, for certain drugs, that product and it, that increase is actually saving lives, um, which is what we're all in healthcare to do. Absolutely. Yeah. It's, I, I gotta tell you, uh, I love the name. I love the logo. I love what you're building. And just so the audience knows the goal is to have you on the podcast again, at some point, this is really your intro to, to our audience, uh, letting them know what you do. I'm sure some of them have heard of you, but some of them probably haven't. And, uh, hopefully now they'll, they'll have a good grasp, uh, grasp on, uh, what you're doing, what you're building and can follow your story like, uh, we will as well. So thank you so much for, for being on the podcast. Yeah. Thanks for having me. And, uh, here really soon in the next three weeks or less, uh, anyone in the country can use our platform. Just when you go to your prescriber and they write a prescription, have them send it to gift health RX partners. And that kind of enters our prescription brain. And then we help you save money and find a pharmacy that's uh, super, super convenient that can get that delivery to you in hours. Love it. Awesome. Cool. Very excited. Well, Hey, thank you so much and uh, all the best. Yes. Thank you. Have a great day.